Thank you. <laughs> I like it. Uh, trash Squatch, I think I that was costume the of the year. Squatch. I like inflatable, trash like the T Rexes. Yeah, what is the big one? <laughs> right. That's it, it. Really is a simple. It's it's like, come on, I, I love you know, it. You, we've all seen it. Someone yeah. just yeah. don't litter. Come on, I know. guys. There's garbage. Keep it in your car. Throw it away. Yeah, not hard Trust to do. Uh, it's not feeling super spooky. I mean, we're talking mm -hmm. even like I looked what 80 at some point next week. Next I mean, week. it feels Comet. amazing. We yeah. got comments. I know. Yeah. I know. Yeah. So let's get to the Skynet camera because it's it's tiny. But I was able to see the comment on the Skynet camera tonight. And if you head outside and you look west, look towards the sunset, you might see it. I know you're looking at the screen and you're probably squinting. It's over here. I know it's so tiny. But if you get up close to it, it's going to be right on the horizon. It will get more and more faint in the next couple days. Key thing that will help you identify whether or not it is the comet or an airplane is the uh, the direction of the comet will be towards the horizon. So if you see it going high up in the sky, that's an airplane, right? It's bird, it's plane, it's Superman. No, if it's a comet, it's headed towards the horizon. Mid 60s uh, is where we topped out today. It's a couple degrees warmer than what we had yesterday. Overnight tonight, we're going to dip back down into the 30s. So another frosty night. Big, bright moon, the full hunter's moon peaked last night. Yeah. It'll be big and bright overnight tonight. 50, all right, boys, simmer down over there. Can you hear them in the background? Oh my word, I feel like I'm at home with my kids. All right, 60s is where we sit right now. We're gonna tumble into the 30s tonight. You gotta cover your plants if you wanna keep them going. 50s to right around 60s where we sit right now. We've had frost the last couple mornings. So if you noticed it around your neighborhood, it's going to be in the same spots overnight tonight. Dipping into the 30s, 70 tomorrow. So we start adding a few degrees each afternoon. Staying dry, though. This is around the 18th day in a row that we have not had measurable rain. So flash drought continues to be a concern across the area. Burn permits are in place. We may be talking about burn bans coming in over the next week or so because it looks like it's not just the next seven days that will stay dry. We may end the month on a dry note. So be smart. Everything is crispy. It's impacting fall color. Temperatures, they're going to warm up to right around 80 next week. Boys, you can have it now.